Hey everybody, it's Mr. MathBlog here and we're starting a new chapter and this lesson is counting equal groups. Okay, don't forget all your lessons can be found at MrMathBlog.com. So here's our essential question is how can we use equal groups to find out how many are in all? Okay, well equal groups have the same number of objects in each group. That's why they're called equal groups. So here John builds model cars. So far he has built six cars. Each car has four wheels, so how many wheels are there in all? Isn't that a pretty slick looking model car right there? I used to build model cars. They're fun. Anyways, so how many wheels are on each car? Well, there's four wheels on each car. How many equal groups of wheels are there? Well, uh, there's six cars, so there's going to be six equal groups. So how can we find out how many wheels there are in all? We can uh, use counters, and that's what we're going to do in this lesson, to count uh, four wheels on six cars. Okay. So here we're going to use counters to model the uh, equal groups here. So you're going to need some counters. So since there's six cars, we have six equal groups right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to first draw four counters in each group, and then we'll skip count by fours until we say all six numbers right there, because there's six equal groups. Okay, so here's the first group of fours right here. So here's four counters right here, so that counts as four. So we're going to continue this and do four here, four here, four here, and then we'll count by fours. We'll skip count by fours. So four, what's four plus four, guys? Well, that's eight. So four plus four is eight. And then eight plus four is 12. 12 plus four, what's 12 plus four? Well, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, okay? And then four more is 20, and then 20 plus four is 24, okay? So, uh, there are six groups with four wheels in each group, and so there are 24 wheels in all. Okay, nice and easy, right? Hey, what if John had eight cars? How could we find the total number of wheels? Well, we can take what we had in six cars, and then we can just uh, continue using the counters two more times, because here's six cars, so if he had eight, we'd just do it two more times. So we take this number, plus four, give us 28, and then plus 4 again would get us 32. Or we can just skip count by 4s two more times, because here's 6 groups of 4, which is 24. So plus 4 is 28, plus 4 more is 32, so you can just skip count by 4. So there would be 32 on there. Here's another example. So we're going to count equal groups to find the total. Greg, Peter, and Bobby each have $5. How many dollars do they have in all? Okay, so how many dollars does each person have? Well, each person has $5. How many equal groups of dollars are there? Well, since there's three boys right here, there's going to be three equal groups right there. All right, so what we're going to do is draw counters in each group. So think there are uh, three groups of $5. So here's my three groups. So here would be Greg, Peter, and Bobby. Okay, and what we're going to do is place uh, five counters in each group. So here's five counters. That will represent $5. Okay, let's do another five counters for Peter. That's going to be another $5. Here's another five counters for Bobby. That's another $5. So... Uh, there are three fives in there. So let's go ahead and skip count to find out how many. Do you guys know how to count by fives, you guys? So five, ten, fifteen right there. So they have fifteen dollars all together right there. Hey, let's try this, you guys. Let's uh, count equal groups to find out how many. What if they gave you a picture like this, okay? Can you see there are three groups of two right here? So there's three groups of twos or two tires. So there's just like uh, on a bicycle, there's um, uh, each bicycle has uh, two tires, so it's like three bicycles. So there's three twos right here, so let's skip count by twos. Do you guys know how to count by twos? Two, four, six, okay? Now if there's another one, it'd be eight. If there's another one, it'd be ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten, okay? But here, there's only three groups, so here's one, two, three groups, so two, four, six. So how many wheels are there? There's six wheels right there. This is pretty easy to count anyways. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, but this one's a little bit harder right here. Okay, here there are, um, how many groups are there? There's four groups and each group has seven in them. So there's four groups of seven or four sevens. So we'll skip count by sevens, okay? So we're gonna do it four times. One, two, three, four. Okay, what's seven plus seven, you guys? It's 14, and then we do 14 plus seven, and if you get stuck, 
Use your fingers, you guys. It's okay. Just use your fingers. And it's 14 plus 7. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. So, so there would be 21. And then 21 plus 7. If you have to use your fingers again, go ahead. But you should get to 28. So there are 28 counters in here. Okay, guys. Hey, if you found this video helpful, would you click like and take care.